what is DDR4? I think the least helpful explanation I could give for this topic is, well, it's short for Double Data Rate Fourth Generation Synchronous Dynamic Random Access Memory. And at this point, you're probably sitting there going, DRAM it, Linus, those are just words. I want to know what it does. OK, fine. Let's start with what memory, or RAM, is actually for in your system. Let's imagine for a moment that uh, a builder is like a CPU doing work, and tools are like data. So a processor's cache is a very small amount of incredibly fast storage directly on board. This is kind of like the hands of our builder. He can't keep much there, but it's really fast to access. Next up is RAM, or working memory. This is whatever our builder can store on his belt or nearby as he works. It's slower to get to than cache, and he can't keep everything he could possibly need there, but it should be enough to complete whatever's the current task. Next up is mass storage, which would be your SSD or hard drive. This is much slower than RAM to access, kind of like going down the ladder to grab something from his truck. And then if we wanted to keep the analogy going even after it's worn out its welcome, we could say that off-site storage, like over the internet, is kind of like driving to the store to buy a new tool outright. It's that much slower again. So there you have it. RAM is the tools, or data, bring it back to computers, that your CPU needs to complete its current task or tasks. So the more of it you have, the less often you, the builder, will need to go down the ladder to retrieve things, and the faster it is, the less downtime you'll need to deal with every time you realize you're holding your drill when actually you need a circular saw. On to DDR4 specifically. It's the next evolutionary step forward in memory technology from DDR3. I know, go figure, right? But JDEC hasn't been sitting on their thumbs for the past half a decade, and this isn't a small upgrade. Compared to DDR3, it offers over 20 new features. So I think it goes without saying that it's not backwards compatible, and you'll need a new motherboard and CPU to use it. Sounds expensive. Why would I even want that, Linus? Well. First up, it's going to improve performance. Aside from allowing much higher clock speeds, we're talking 3200 MHz stock, DDR4 is a bigger change than it might at first appear to be with some clever architectural wizardry designed to improve performance, particularly in multi-core systems. Next up, we've got capacity. Right off the bat, DDR4 will be capable of double the density per die, but perhaps equally important is that it can support up to eight dies per package instead of four, which combined translates into an effective quadrupling of DDR3's theoretical maximum capacity of 128 gigabytes per module. Yeah, 512 gigabyte memory sticks, baby. But of course, for now, that benefit, along with some of the others, won't be very applicable to home users. A couple more such improvements are the 40% or so reduction in power consumption due to DDR4's better power management and lower operating voltage, as well as its support for much more advanced error detection, prevention, and correction. This last one is gonna be key, as capacities grow to the point where errors become actually inevitable. Speaking of inevitable errors, going to the store to buy replacement razors if you haven't already signed up for Dollar Shave Club. Yes, it's been a while since we've talked about Dollar Shave Club, but that doesn't mean that the scary man with the weapon, obscenities, private army, and trained bear is gone. Oh no, he's still watching you in the bathroom. Or maybe that was me. Someone's watching you shave. I mean, what did you think we were watching you doing? That's gross. We'll never know who it was. Anyway, the point is that for just a few bucks a month, Dollar Shave Club delivers high quality razors and other bathroom supplies straight to your door. The club is available in the US, Canada, and Australia for my friends down under. And aside from their great razor blades and shave butter, they've got one wipe Charlie's butt wipes for men for my enemies down under, if you catch my drift. Anyway, that's pretty much it. Head on over to dollarshaveclub.com slash Linus and join the club to start shaving time and shaving money. Thanks for watching guys, like this video if you liked it, dislike it if you disliked it, leave a comment if you have suggestions for future episodes of Fast as Possible or just anything to say to us about this particular one. I think that's pretty much it. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you again next time.